To continue through each of the following instructional slides, use the pause and play buttons below this window. Please familiarize yourself with the basic functionality of your camera. There are many resources available to you, including the camera manual. They're all available online, as well as YouTube and Google. We've kept this tutorial as simple as possible. However, we do not expect everyone to grasp this concept immediately. While the initial setup, the first time you do this, may seem a bit tedious, it's really quite simple. And if practiced only a couple of times, it will become second nature. Set your camera on a sturdy tripod. Turn it on and compose your photo. Take care to compose the best possible photo. Remember, what you see is what you get. Set your shooting mode to AV or aperture priority. Do not use a flash. Set your on-camera flash, if you have one, to off. Using your menu functions, set the quality of your image to large JPEG. Set your white balance to AWB, or Auto White Balance. Set your color space to Adobe RGB. Set your picture style to faithful or neutral. Set your metering mode to evaluative metering or average metering. Set your AF mode or autofocus mode to one shot. Set your ISO or sensitivity speed to 400. Set your f-stop or aperture to f22. Set your drive mode to self-timer. If you have a two-second self-timer option, use this. Otherwise, leave it at its default. Set your AEB or auto exposure bracketing function to one stop increments, minus one, zero, plus one. Option one on some of the better cameras is that you can set your EV plus minus button which shifts your middle exposure to minus two if possible. Now you will shoot a minus three, a minus two, and minus one in your bracketing sequence. Option number two. If you cannot set your plus minus button to show a minus three, then reset your auto exposure bracketing or AEB to plus minus 1.6 or one and two thirds increments. In order to lock your focus, press your shutter button only halfway down to get a focus on your subject. You will see the focus engage. If you accidentally press the shutter button all the way down and the camera takes some photos, erase just those photos and try again. Now, turn autofocus off. Whatever you just focused on will stay in focus throughout the next process. Now, press the shutter button all the way down. When the timer is done, three photos will be taken automatically. If you choose option number two, plus minus 1.6, then you are finished shooting. 
jump to the end slide in this presentation. If you were able to and you choose option number 1, which is minus 3, minus 2, minus 1 in your bracketing sequence, then you will get a much better final product. Please continue. Without moving the camera, turn the AEB auto exposure bracketing to off and set the plus minus button to zero or the center. Press the shutter button completely with the timer still engaged. One photo will be taken. Set your AEB or auto exposure bracketing function to one stop increments, minus one, zero, plus one. Set your plus minus button to plus two. So now you will shoot plus one, plus two, plus three in your bracketing. You may have to increase the ISO sensitivity to 1600 or more if you see the shutter speed is flashing 30 seconds on the menu screen on the back of your camera when you press the shutter button halfway down. If this is going to happen at all, it would typically happen on the last two or three photos of the end sequence, which you are just about to begin. If this situation arises, delete the photos that you have just taken of this scene only. Then, set the ISO sensitivity to the new setting, 1600, and begin the entire sequence again. Press the shutter button completely with the timer still engaged. Three photos will be taken.